I'm going to start off by uh, having you look at the tip of this pen and uh, can you follow with your, with your eyes without moving your head? Mm -hmm. the, the eyes are moving symmetrically. Um, and now I'm going to check the size of your pupils, okay? The left and the right pupil are about four millimeters, so they are equal and they're also round. Um, now I'm going to turn on this light and I want you to look over the side of, of my shoulder, okay? Great. Both eyes are constricting. Um, and now I want you to keep looking at the side of my shoulder and I'm going to do the same thing, but I'm just going to just look at one at a time, okay? okay. Alright, and then both eyes are uh, reactive to light, um, indirect and direct light. And then lastly, I want you to look at the tip of this pen and then I'm going to move it closer to your nose and I want you to follow the tip of the pen, okay? okay. Both eyes did converge and the pupils did constrict. So the eyes are equal, I mean the pupils are equal, round, reactive to light. Equal, round, reactive to light, and they are accommodating. So now I'm, um, can I uh, look at your hair? Yeah. The hair is clean and dry. There's no lesions and there's no parasites or anything. Um, and can I palpate your neck? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, first, before I palpate your neck, I want to look in your mouth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Can you open your mouth for me? Can you push your head back a little bit? The teeth are white and there's no sign of any dental caries. The tongue is pink. Can you put your tongue up? The tongue is pink and the... Uh, is midline. <laughs> Can you put your tongue back out? And then the tonsils are at about a grade one. There's no swelling and the back of the throat is pink. Tonsils are also pink and there's nothing red. Okay, so now now I want to palpate your neck. Is that okay if I inspect and look at it? So your neck has no swelling. I don't see any masses. Um, and now I'm touching it. Again, there's no swelling. Your uh, thyroid appears to be in midline as well. And there's no masses or anything. Okay, great. So um, can you turn around for me so I can... Um, Check out your breathing. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna place this uh, stethoscope in multiple spots on your back and listen to you breathe. When you feel, feel me change a spot, can you uh, take a nice uh, deep breath in and out for me? Yeah. The breathing is clear and there's no there's no crackling. Um, and then can you turn back around so we can uh, check your breathing? Yeah. 
So anteriorly, it was clear. I mean, posteriorly, it was clear and there was no crackling. So now I'm going to check on the air anterior. We're going to do the same thing. Um, and then when we get to around your chest area, can you move your breast out the way so I can hear? Okay. Again, everything sounds clear. There's no crackling, and um, everything sounds uh, pretty, pretty, pretty cool. Okay. <laughs> um, so now I want to check. Um, can you turn back around so I could check the curvature of your spine? I would have done this earlier, um, but I'm going to do it now. <laughs> um, I'm going to feel down the down your spine and everything sound feels good. Um, the spine is straight and the curvature is good. And then can you take a deep breath in and out for me? The breathing is symmetrical. Okay, so now um, if you could take a lay down on the bed so we can look at your abdomen. Are you having any abdominal pain today? Okay. Um, first, I'm going to uh, inspect the abdomen and I see that the flesh is tan in color and it's pink. Um, there's no lesions and no um, no scarring or anything. The umbilicus has, the umbilicus does have a secondary lesion um, and it's uh, inward. The curvature of the abdomen is, round, uh, is flat and there's no um, distension. So you said you're not having any pain? No. So that means we're gonna start at the right left quadrant. Okay, so I, have, I heard about 10 bowel sounds, which is regular. Um, and then now I'm going to uh, palpate on your abdomen. Okay. And you let me know if you feel any pain or uh, discomfort, okay? Okay. Is there any pain here? Nope. Any pain? The patient experienced no pain or tenderness uh, while I was palpating on her abdomen and um, there is it, it is soft and there is no distension. Okay, so can you sit up for me? Yeah. You want to move back up to the chair? Uh, no, it's okay. Can you just like, um, yeah, try to turn around? <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to be checking the kidneys. Um, so I'm going to... I'm gonna 
Percuss on the, your back, okay? You tell me if you feel any un uncomfort. Okay. Anything? Nope. Nope. Okay, great. So the patient isn't feeling any discomfort um, when I percuss on their back. And then Thing is down. Next one is going to be down to the side like this again. You're going to just bend your elbow all the way up, all the way down. Okay, I'm going to feel it while you do it this time. Okay, all the way up, all the way down. Good. Okay, one more time. Relax. Okay, this one's gonna be the one with the pin, so I'm gonna have you hold it out like this, keep your elbow to your side, and you're gonna go all the way down, palm down, and then back like this. Okay, go ahead, all the way down, back up, and all the way, good, back. Okay, we're gonna measure it now. Go ahead and go all the way down. Okay, and back up. And other way. Okay, relax. So now I need you to scoot up to the table for me. <clears throat> okay. So next one we're going to do is this one where you put your hand straight like that and just bend your thumb in for me. There we go. Actually, I'm going to have your elbow in close to you like this. Okay. And the first one that you're going to do is in this way. Good. And then back out. And then back the other way. Good. And straight. Okay, now I'm going to measure that. Okay, and in towards you. Okay, back out. And then out. Okay, the last one is have your hand like this for me. Keep your elbow in. There we go. Okay, and then um, thumb in towards you. Here, you got it? Mm -hmm. Okay. And then go all the way up again for me. Good. Okay, now I'm going to have you come down to about halfway. And then I'm going to give you some resistance, but don't let me move you, okay? Hold it. Good. And relax. Good. Okay. So now I want you to go back as far as you can. Take your shoulder back and relax. Okay. One more time for me. Good. Okay, I'm going to move you back about halfway down. Okay. And don't let me move you. Good. Okay. So relax. Now I 
want you to go all the way out to your side, up like this. Good, and all the way down. Good, okay, now we're gonna come back to halfway. Okay, don't let me move you. Okay, and relax. Good, and the next one, we're gonna do. Okay, so now I want you to take your arm out like this. Good, and I want you to lift it all the way across your body like we did a while ago. Good, and then all the way back. One more time for me. All the way across, all the way back. Good, okay, I'm gonna put you about halfway and I'm gonna give you some resistance. Don't let me move you. Good, okay, relax. Now you're gonna turn over onto your belly. Again with that left arm. Good. Mm -hmm. And then come down. I'm going to feel your shoulder here. Good. All the way back. Good. I'm going to do about halfway again. Okay. And don't let me move you. Okay. And relax. Good. So now we're going to do the same thing that we did a while ago whenever you were halfway off. You're going to go up and down like that. So scoot this way for me. So the next one we're going to do is I want you to just take your arm up like this and back down. Good. I'm going to hold it here. Okay. Same thing. All the way up and back down about halfway. I'm going to give you resistance. Don't let me move you. Good. Okay. Back down. Good. So now I want you to take your arm all the way up like this for me. Elbow to the sky and go straight up in the air. Yep. And then back down about halfway. Okay, let me test this now. Don't let me move you. And relax. Good. Okay. Okay, so come all the way off the table like this for me. Good. Back down. Now about halfway. Good. Okay, don't let me move you. Good. Okay, now turn over this way. Same thing. All the way up. Good. All the way down. About halfway. Good. Don't let me move you. Now we're gonna do this one again, back and forth like that. Yep, you can keep it on the table right here. Mm -hmm. And over, got it, good. Okay, I'm gonna keep you about right here. Okay, don't let me move you. Good, okay, now all the way back over. Good, and back. Good, keep you right here. your shoulder you're gonna do this with your shoulder all the way up and all the way down and I'm gonna hold here so come all the way up good and then all the way down good I'm gonna get behind you okay do it again good and all the way down good okay go onto your back now good so now you're gonna do this movement like that but you're keeping keeping your arm on the table. So I'm going to move you into it. Good. Okay. Now flip back over onto your side for me again. And I'm going to move you into this position this time, okay? All the way up. All the way down. Good. Okay. Now go back onto your back for me. And scoot that way as much as you can. this. Good. Okay. And we're going to go in with your elbow. So we're going to go all the way in, all the way out. Okay. And I want you 
want you to do it now. And back up. Good. Okay. And then the next one we're going to do is um, you're going to get up for this one. So you're going to come sit right here in the chair. your belly. Good. Um, do it one more time for me. Keep your elbow down like this. Okay. And you're going to go all the way out and then all the way back in. Make sure to hit me. You can shine a light in there, okay? Okay. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hold this object here. You focus on that for me. Okay. And then focus on the wall behind it. Very good. You can get a feel of your temple arteries now. I'm going to do is I'm going to fill up your jaw. Okay, keep it open for me and close. Okay, and I'm going to fill your lymph nodes, okay? Any tenderness anywhere that touched you? No. Okay, no tenderness anywhere. You didn't have any swelling. Very good. You to clench your teeth together for me. Nicely on the exit. Very good. Okay. I'm going to inspect your nose. Everything looks good there. Okay. If you could um, put your finger over one nostril just to close that and sniff for me. Okay. And do the same with the other side. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. I'm going to test your uh, sensory, okay? So I'm going to just come in when you can feel it. Mm -hmm. No drainage, no again. Feel any lumps or anything? Feel any pain when I'm touching on your ear? Very good. Okay, and now I'm going to do a whisper test, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to whisper something and I want you to repeat what I said, okay? Okay. Ball. your sinuses to make sure that those aren't tender. Any tenderness there? Mm -hmm. Okay. And then look into your mouth. Do for me. And say, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, very good. And my patient does not have her tonsils. I would at this time grade them if they were present. Stick your tongue out for me. Okay, this is the midline. Very good. Okay, now if you would um, shake your head no for me and touch each ear to your shoulder. I'm going to need you to do that against resistance for me. Okay, and then same here. Okay, and chin to chest for me and head back. Perfect. Just shrug your shoulders. Listen for Curly. Very good. Okay. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to look at 
your back, okay? <clears throat> Just gonna inspect there. Everything looks good. My patient doesn't want to be exposed any more than what she is for this video, so we've been leaving her tank top on. Um, no lesions or swelling or anything on her back. gonna go um, down your back and check for tactile premises. I'm gonna get you to say 99 for me, okay? Mm -hmm. 99, 99, 99, 99. Very good. I'm gonna feel here. I'm gonna get you to breathe for me. radial ulnar and brachial pulses in each arm, okay? You know, raise your arms above your head for me and all the way to the back as far as you can go and go out to the side straight out and down in like a V. Very good. Okay, I'm going to do your arms straight out here and then in and out with your elbow. Very good. And I'm going to hold this out for me, get you to pull against me. Okay, and pull back up for me and just push. Very good. And get you to put your fist out like this and just pull them up, like just like this, and then down. Very good. <clears throat> Gonna get you to put your hands out flat and spread your fingers apart and back together. And now, if you'll hold your fingers out and touch each finger to your thumb on each hand. Very good. Get you to hold your arms straight out to the side and touch each finger to your nose, like every other finger, like, and do it real fast. Okay, very good. Okay, the next thing I'm going to get you to do is hold your hands out and close your eyes for me. I'm going to draw an object on your hand and I'll just want you to tell me what it is, okay? Hate. <clears throat> You're gonna put an object in your hand. I want you to tell me what it is, okay? Cotton. A pen. Very good. Okay. Next thing I'm gonna do is your reflexes. So if you'll put one arm across and just kind of dangle your arm over it. Okay. And do the other arm the same way. And next, I'm going to get you to just kind of let your arm relax. Yeah, that and hands on the side. Okay, and the next thing I'm going to do is get you to break your reflex. Okay, very good. Okay, next 
thing I'm going to do is inspect your chest. It's symmetrical and um, people rise and fall. They have great um, work in prison. Let me get you to lie down for me, please, Danny. any swelling or edema on the feet. I'm going to get you to lift one leg up for me, please. And lift the other leg up. Very good. Do one knee to your chest. And same with the other leg. And we get you to turn your knees out as far as you can. Swing your leg out to the side and back and do the other the same way. Perfect. Get you to just like lift your foot up and down. And we'll pull up against my hand and push down on the gas. Very good. 